Hey, what's going on, everybody? Um, welcome back to the channel here at Crypto Nation. If you're new here, it's uh, totally free to subscribe and hit the like button for our post notifications. Um, anyways, let's get right into it. You know what? <laughs> I've been watching this coin for a good while, and I, I just couldn't help myself but to finally, you know, do a video on this um, on this in particular pro project. Now, I got this in my top. I definitely got this in my top like five or six uh, blue chip um, projects. Uh, right now, uh, Helium is ranked number 52. Now, this coin is, I believe, is also connected to Helium Mobile. We all know about Helium Mobile. You, that That's also on Coinbase, but that's the, the smaller one that's at a percentage of a penny. And then you also got another coin called Helium IoT. And we're, I'm going to cover Helium, I, Helium IoT as well. Uh, for some reason, that Helium I, IoT don't have the, um, it's not on any, like, um, tier one exchanges and i don't understand why but i'm gonna do a, a to totally separate video on that one but anyways helium man look at this um um I, I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you guys but i don't i don't know why i overlooked this project i should have got in this coin a year ago or even if i would have got in like six months ago i would have been up nice i don't this is one project i regret overlooking but it's not too late because i feel that i looked at the all-time chart it looked like it got over 50 dollars in a, in the last bull run but anyways, we're, we're going to go over that. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button for post notifications. All right, so Helium is up over, it's up over 483% for the year, 74% for the month. One thing I've noticed about this coin, it, it's, it's very rarely in the red. When I looked at it, it's always in the green. I'm like, wow, and this coin is always in the green. It's never, it's very, I very rarely see it like in the red. Or if I ever do see it in the red, it'll probably be like maybe in a one hour or maybe a little bit down in the, in the one day. But I've been watching this coin for a while. It, now, over the last few months, we went through flash crashes and everything. And I'm looking at the one month. It's up. This coin is up 74% for the one month. A month ago, this coin was at $4.70. Now it's at $8.50. I'm like, wow, why wasn't I in this play? <laughs> and then for the, it's up 29% for the one week. It's like this coin is just straight bullish. I think this coin is on, honestly is on its way up to like, you know, 40 to 50 bucks. That's what I believe. And that 1.3 billion market cap, honestly, it's just a beginning. I feel that this coin, um, this coin can, can possibly become a top 10 crypto. I think top, I'll say top 10 to 15 crypto. It has that potential. Why? Now, why would I say that? Because of real world utility. You know, with mobile hotspots, that that's something that the whole world is using, right? Um, you, you know, with you know wide area networks and all that kind of stuff. Um, but anyways, let's go over this right quick. Go back here. Let's go look at do a little bit of TA. Then I'm I'm gonna try to dive deeper into the project. This is probably gonna be one of my longer longer videos. Bear with me. So yeah, um, November 13th of 2021, this coin was at fifty dollars. Now I think this this time around, because this is a super cycle, I believe this coin is gonna go higher than that. Now I can see this coin going up to like hitting 80, 80 to a hundred dollars this cycle. You know, I can see this coin hitting about 80 to a hundred dollars by spring of 2025. That's why I'm definitely going to start slowly getting into this coin. It, it, it's, it's, it's always it, bullish. It's always green. But anyways, you look at that all time chart. Uh, it's up over 3000% as I make this video over 3000% in all time chart. That is really good. That is nothing but growth. This coin literally printed over the last like you know uh four years okay when this coin first came out back in 2020 let me see here okay it looked like the okay it looked like the project was released to the crypto community of uh january 18th of 2021 okay then i think that was during the last bull run and it was at i'm seeing 27 cents right here and then it came 27 cents and then it quickly pumped up to like a dollar yeah so when the coin was released it said right here 27 cents you know then it quickly came up it pumped fast hold on just one second is that 27 cents or is that a dollar 20 hold on just one second i don't want to give the wrong okay i'll get Hold on just a second. Okay, I guess when it came out, it was at 26. That's what it shows here. Okay. And then you see here, $2 here. Um, 
the coin moved really fast. But anyways, the 2021 bull run, to make a long story short, uh, $50 and went all the way up to $50.77. It looked like, it then, you know, we had a, the long bear market. It came all the way down, but it didn't go down that much. Well, okay, well, it did. It went all the way down to um, looking at this all-time chart, $4. And this is about where we're at now. Okay, and it looked like um, we are okay. It looked like we already hit nine dollars back in. Okay, it looked like back in March we hit just it hit nine dollars. All right, so now let's take a look at that one year. This is the all time chart. Looking at this chart, man, this coin is just nothing but straight bullish. Okay, a year ago this coin was at a dollar fifty. About a year ago, a dollar fifty. It came all the way up here. See, guys, I like to look at historical data on coins. Definitely like to look at historical data to see where, because it, it can also show where this can go in the future. Okay. January 2023. No, excuse me. December 2023, before the new year, it was at $8. Then it came down a little bit. Came up $9 here. Then came back down to like $4. Um, yeah. So looking at that chart, that one year chart, you know, looks pretty good. It was a little bit up and down, but the low was like at one dollar. So it, so whoever was in this play at about even a year ago when it was at a dollar fifty, hey, you guys are pretty much up, right? So let's take a look at the one month chart. Now this is where it gets good. It went from four dollars and seventy four cents all the way up. All the way up to uh, $8.36. So, yeah, to make a long story short, looking at the one month, this coin is up uh, almost 80% in a one month. That's a, that's really good. And you got to think, guys, we went through a, we went through like a few flash crashes, about two different, two or three different flash crashes. And it seemed like, it, it, it seemed basically, to make a long story short, it looked like this coin never was affected by any of the flash crashes. This coin went the opposite direction. So this coin definitely... Is not riding with Bitcoin. This coin is riding its own, its own uh, pattern. This coin is definitely not following Bitcoin. Bitcoin dips. It doesn't matter. This coin goes, still goes up like Bitcoin. I don't care what direction you go. We're going up regardless. <laughs> That's what I noticed about this coin. Uh, like I said, I, I wish like a few months back. I wish I wish I would have gotten this coin. You know, I would have been I would have been like most almost double my portfolio back then. But instead, I got wrecked being in the wrong place. I guess you know. But you know it's crypto, uh, so sometimes you never know what this market is going to do. But yeah, Helium Mobile, this is definitely a coin I wish I was in a few months back. You know, before a lot of us got wrecked during our during the um during the flash crashes, because this coin is definitely not following Bitcoin. Um, looking at this one month chart, you, you're not going to see too many cryptos that's up um, in the one month, almost 80 percent in a one month, despite with the crashes we've been going through. The seven day chart. Look, we're up 26%. And so this coin is definitely heading up to like now. I'll say in the short term, this coin is definitely look like it's heading up to like twenty to twenty-five dollars in the short in the short term. Definitely. Um yeah. Uh, but anyway, so as far as the uh the utility behind it, you know, the whole thing with mobile. Like I said, this coin I believe is is, is connected to Helium Mobile and also um, another one called Helium IoT. So this is definitely all part of that whole Web3 deep end and everything. But but this one is all dealing with mobile, you know, hotspots, wide area network, and this is real world utility. And I heard that Helium, and this is an actual product, a service that people can use, you know, besides other crypto projects. Like when you think about it, what what how does people can actually use it? You know, you know what I mean? So a lot of these cryptos really that are out there is not going to really have a, a real use case utility that people is actually using a service. You know, there's only when you really think about it, there's only real, really a few crypto projects out there where people can actually use a service where it has a real use case utility that's actually being used like right now. You know what I mean? This is another reason why I regret not being in this, but I'm definitely going to try to get a good entry point here in the near future. Uh, I definitely want to wait on the dip to see if this can dip a little bit and try to get an entry. But 
the way this coin is looking, it's just keep going up and up. I never, I very rarely see this coin in a red. Uh, but anyway, it said Helium Hand is a decentralized blockchain power network for Internet of Things IoT devices. Launched July 2019, the Helium Mainnet allows low-powered wireless devices to communicate with each other and send data across its network of nodes. Uh, nodes come in the form of so-called hotspots, which are a combination of wireless gateway and blockchain mining device. Users who operate nodes thus mine and earn rewards in Helium's native cryptocurrency token. Um, Helium's goal is to prepare IoT communication for the future, identifying um, in, in the excuse me, in the in the uh, acquisitions and current infrastructure from the birth. And um, Helium's goal is to prepare IoT communication uh, for future, identifying um, in, in, in inequities, current infrastructure from its birth, 2013. In 2013, it said, who are the founders? Um, Helium's three co-founders, Amir, Halim, Sean, Fanning, and Sean Kerry started the company in 2013. Halim has an active um, esports and game development background Fanning, by contrast, is well known for developing Napster, uh, the music sharing service, which was one of the first mainstream peer-to-peer P2P internet services in the late 1990s. Um, Kerry, meanwhile, held multiple development roles prior to Helium, which included advertising um, opt optimization firms were acquired by PayPal. Um, Helium's team now consists of members, which is the... Um, the company says have experience in radio and hardware manufacturing, distributed systems, peer-to-peer -peer and blockchain technologies. Okay, guys. Yeah, so I cover, so I'm gonna not gonna have time to go well. So there's definitely a team behind this. Uh, you know, it has you know two co-founders, it looked like. Uh, but yeah, but and then uh you could dive deeper, there's a lot of information, but yeah, this is actually a real use case that's all that's already being used, you know, like helium, um, you know, T-Mobile and all that, they're all connected. Let me see here. I don't, I don't know why, man. I, I, this is a, this is a blue chip that I should have already honestly had in my, when, when I look at a blue chip cryptocurrency, uh, this is a coin I'm definitely eventually going to get in my portfolio before this coin really takes off to like, you know, 20, 30, 40, $50 a coin. Cause I definitely see this coin get, getting back up to where it was in the last bull run. This coin is bare minimum. Um, bare minimum, this coin is going to hit between fifty to sixty dollars a coin come twenty twenty five. Yeah, so I'm definitely going to um, get in. It's not too late. Now, okay, I didn't go over tokenomics. Okay, actually, I really look at it on Coin Gecko, Coin Market Cap with tokenomics be off sometimes. Two hundred and twenty three million max supply, total supply the same price two hundred twenty three million, and one hundred and sixty nine million is in circulation. So that you know has pretty good. Um, tokenomics that look like that's about um i want to say that's about about that's about 70 to 75 percent of the supply so yeah it has it seemed like it has decent tokenomics um current market cap 1.4 billion market cap but like i said i believe this market cap can definitely get up i believe this can get up to like a 20 billion uh market cap this coin i can see this getting up to a 20 billion market cap well, 15, I'll say very least 2025, um, I can say this coin can get up. Like I said, none of this is financial advice. I'm not an expert, but bare minimum, this can get up to a 15 billion market cap. That's what I'm saying, because this has a real use case where people is already like actually using this technology. You know what I mean? You talk about cryptocurrency. You know, of course, there's a there's a lot of, you know, so-called shit coins out there. People are just, you know, pumping anything. But this is definitely a real deal. Why do you think? Look at the price. The proof is in a pudding with this coin, really. Can't deny it, you know. Um, even when the crypto market is going down, this coin still goes up. That's, you know, that's really amazing. But anyways, tell, tell me guys what you guys think about Helium. Um, then my next one, I'm going to do another one on Helium IoT. Uh, that coin is connected. That, that Helium IoT um, is that that's more of a more of a, a lower cap one. Where I think I think that coin is at about 13, 14 percent of a penny right now. But that's that's coin has also been very bullish um, a few months back. That coin was only at about one to two cents, one or two percent of a penny. Now it's at 14. I'm going to cover that one as well. And then you also know about Helium Mobile. That's that one is on Coinbase. But it's been kind of that coin has been kind of, you know, 
uh, not really pumping right now, but but yeah, um, I'm gonna definitely cover you know cover these coins more, uh, especially helium. This is the blue chip. Uh, I definitely need to get this in my. Um, I should have already had this in my portfolio, but like I said, it's another one that I unfortunately had overlooked. But I've been looking at this coin for the past like few weeks. Uh, but anyways, that's my take on helium. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button for post notifications. Also, hey, get the channel membership three dollars a month. Unlike other crypto content creators, I ain't gonna try to sell you guys no uh, package or nothing, no Patreon trying to sell you. Hey, if you want to support the channel, you like my content, just get the channel membership. I'm gonna have my updated portfolio over there and I'm gonna be dropping just uh, private content to the channel members, so don't miss out. And that's a way to support the channel, just $3 a month. But anyways, guys, that is my take on Helium. Um, this is, this coin, this is definitely a banger. And, and look at this, green, green, green. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this is definitely heading up to like $20 in the short term. Hey, but hey, tell me what you think. I hope everybody have a good Friday. That is my take on Helium. Um, or what's the ticker or hint? Let me see here. Helium or um, HNT hint. But anyways, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.